We are in a race with climate change, with biodiversity loss, a race to ensure that people and nature can thrive on this planet. At the Nature Conservancy, we protect the places that can help us win this race. Welcome to the Cary Landreth Preserve at the McLeod River. The preserve encompasses 2,300 acres and six miles of the McLeod River system. And it's home to black bear, mountain lion, and rainbow trout, and something very special. We're essentially at one of the headwaters of uh, the Sacramento River. The McLeod River flows into the Sacramento River and then into Shasta Lake and then past Shasta Dam, which then feeds the rest of California, agriculture, urban areas, people, wildlife. So this is it, the beginning of the story. The Nature Conservancy preserved this land nearly 50 years ago, and we've been stewarding it ever since. But the history of people in this region goes back long before that to the Wintu tribe that fished for salmon on these banks for generations. Conserving this property is important because we are at the headwaters of a very large watershed in Northern California that feeds and brings food to millions of people, provides habitat for wildlife. We are stewarding the water that flows down from Mount Shasta. That water is currently threatened by climate change. We're in a multi-year drought. Glaciers are melting. Snowpack is becoming less and less year to year. The McLeod River is fed by glaciers that sit high on Mount Shasta. But with climate change, Shasta's glaciers are melting faster and faster. The Kunwakatan Glacier up on Mount Shasta had a melting and then flow event into Mud Creek, which is a tributary of, of the McLeod River. That created a long duration event of suspended sediment in the river, which completely clouded the lower McLeod River for more than two months. Now, historically, these events are not uncommon. What is uncommon is the duration of that event. We've never seen it happen for more than two months. At the Cary Landreth Preserve at the McLeod River, we have nearly 50 years of data to inform our work. Our preserves are more than just beautiful places. They're living laboratories where we develop techniques to better protect nature and prepare our ecosystems for the impacts of climate change. What we can do here is help to monitor all those changes that are happening in these ecosystems. And this is still a place with cold, fresh, clean water and provides great habitat for numerous species, not just trout, because everything is connected. So it's important to monitor this area and to understand what happens when climate change impacts seasonal snowpack, seasonal rainfall, and the melting of glaciers on Mount Shasta. The McLeod River remains a fisherman's paradise. People come from all over the world to fish for the river system's legendary rainbow trout. But the same thing that sustains these beautiful fish sustains us, water. You need to get people out of their boxes in urban environments so that they can appreciate where water comes from, where the water comes from that they drink, where the water comes from that waters all of the vegetables and fruits that they eat. And being able to share that with people, most of all, is the most important thing that I can do in this job.